John Greening was one of the most exciting footballers ever to represent the Collingwood Football Club. One of the most naturally gifted athletes ever to play the game. A prodigious talent. He was an outstanding and brilliant junior footballer and arrived at Victoria Park from Burnie in Tasmania in 1967. Yeah, look, he was just an exciting young athlete, you know, uh, 6 foot 2, 188 centimetres, uh, moved beautifully. He just looked magnificent and, uh, and you knew it would take a little time but it would all just lock together and, and ultimately it did. Collingwood move into attack by the half forward flank and the mark up there to John Greening, what a rip mark! Everything about John Greening bore the stamp of a champion, superb skills, sure hands and an outrageous spring. He was quick, courageous and fair. Greening played with a sense of freedom and daring that made the freakish seem likely. He played with a joy for the game that was infectious. Well any Collingwood fan, any football fan, just falls in love with someone that plays on the wing that runs like a gazelle and can kick five goals and can kick either feet, handball both hands, mark with the best of them. So. Footy fans fell in love with Johnny Greening uh, and the Mighties were the ones lucky enough to have him playing for them. We had a lot of talented players but uh, no, he was just a gifted natural athlete. Thompson getting the front position, gets a knockout too, a good one up towards Greening, closely attended by Pace. Greening pushing the ball along in front of him, a left foot snap now from the pocket is a nice... Oh, what a shot! A ripper! I tell you what, he slammed it right through... He just had no fear, he would just go where angels fear to tread. I remember playing at Carlton one day and he kicks uh, seven goals uh, playing off the half forward flank and he was probably only about 19 I think, 19 or 20. He just moved so well they, they really found it difficult to match him up. In 1972, as he was reaching his peak he was cruelly felled behind play. He would make a brave recovery and his comeback match in 1974 was one of the most stirring and emotional events in the history of Collingwood. In front of more than 70,000, he led Collingwood onto the MCG, booted a goal with his first kick and was one of the best on the ground as the Magpies recorded a famous victory. No Collingwood fan who witnessed it would ever forget it. In his short career, John Greening was a revelation. He had gifts and ambitions others only dream of. He was one of the greatest to have played at Collingwood, one of the greatest to have played the game.